What's up YouTube? Today we got an awesome video for you. Just got it in the mail, not even 10 minutes ago. It's the HPI WRA Flux, Ken Block Edition. And the good thing is that we don't have to build it, so it won't take us long, because they already built it. A shout out to VortexHobbies.com. Great, great company to work with. It's hard to find this. I'm gonna, I'll put a link in the, uh, in the description below. Go check out their website. They got great products for everything. All kinds of HPI racing, hard to find like this car, super hard to find, and they had it in stock ready to ship. So give, give them a shout out when you get out there and check it out. All right, we're going to open it up. All right, unboxing, check this out for the first time. Look at that, pre-built, ready to go. First off, looks like we got some stickers, instructions. Got everything what we need. And we got, we got some batteries and- All kinds of, yep. It's all the Allen wrenches and everything you need. Show you batteries looks like uh, for the shocks this remote is so huge that whenever we have this look how huge this is compared to our last one yep way bigger look at that already already in like with those little clips get this box out of here looks like it's wrapped around the body clips here yeah Go. Whoa. All right, let's take off that body. All right. Let's check out the body first. Let's go with this first here. I'm gonna show you the rest of it. So the body right now, again, this is a rally car, an on-road and an off-road. So this year it came out with this color changing. Let's see if you can pick that up. Beautiful color changing. Goes from a purple to gray. I mean, look at the detail on this body. Just amazing. Let me get the camera closer. It looks like the actual rally car. Yeah, it's an exact replica of the Ford Fiesta that he runs. And it's just amazing, the detail that they put in this. I mean, the Toyo tires, look at all the monster stickers all over it. You can see how it goes from purple to gray. I mean, the whole flag and everything. It's just amazing how much detail they put into this. Everything's ready to go. Spoilers already screwed on there. Everything's ready. Just amazing. So the good thing is about this car, it looks incredibly amazing. Now for... Now the best part. Look at this beautiful, look at it. Just, it's amazing. The, the wheels, detail. like, the detail and everything looks like so real that it should be like, it can probably... So it, it's four, it's obviously, it's four wheel drive, four wheel drive, however you want to call it. Set up. Rally car. The steering servo, everything is waterproof. It is brushless out of the gate, so it's a 4400. Got a fresh gear in there, everything, yeah. all servo, you have. So you, yep, your receiver, everything is waterproof.
All right, final thoughts. Guys, you can't go wrong with this car. I am just ecstatic the way that it handles, the way that it, it goes over any terrain that you can give it. I mean, it was basically to the size of perspective of the rocks that it was going over, it was basically like a basher. It was going over huge rocks that some other, you know, scale trucks would have issues with. And it just took it because this low center of gravity just keeps it on its wheels. And you saw that, you know, a couple of times, yeah, you're gonna flip it, but it rolls and rolls and it lands back and it's ready to go. I mean, it's, it's just an all around great car. Um, you, yeah, you're not going to be able to take it off huge ramps and all the other stuff that you see, but that's not what this is designed for. It is a true spec rally car. If you guys follow rally, you know what it's about. And of course, Jim Connor with, with Ken Block and, and, you know, the Jim Connor, um, you know, competitions that he does through the parks and everything. It's dirt, it's mud, it's street, you know, it's a little bit of everything and there's a little jumps in there too. But if you're looking for that, that scale rally feel, um, you're not gonna find anything better straight from the box. You may be able to piece something together that, that can handle in different ways, but as far as going to your, your hobby shop, purchasing a car and a battery and getting on the road, you're not gonna find, in my opinion, you're not gonna find anything better. It's just an amazing car, and I can tell you that already that, I mean, I'm going to, I've already fallen in love with it. It's, you know, it's just an amazing car. I can't say anything bad about it. I really can't. And, you know, I may be new to the sport or the hobby, as some people will call it. And I'm sure a lot of you guys, you know, probably saying, well, he doesn't really know much and there's so much more to learn. That's, that's true. But I've been in the cars my whole life. And when they are able to scale down a car and make it have the same attitude as the real car, that's what gets me excited. I mean, even the motor itself sounds like a four, a four cylinder Ford Fiesta, you know, the, the 600 horsepower Ken Block Fiesta turbocharged. I mean, it doesn't even have one of those sound, you know, systems that you can get for cars that give it that turbo sound. But to me, I mean, it just sounds like a four cylinder that's just angry you know and it's just cool to hear that as the tires spin and everything and the tires it just tries to grab and you know it just i don't know as you could tell obviously i'm not very good at talking on film anyway but i'm just over the top excited right now guys if you're looking for a new car if you're looking to get into rally if you're looking for just something fun for most surfaces you can't go wrong with the HPI Racing uh, WR8. Now they have the Nitro that came out. I don't know anything about Nitro except that it's gas, you know, it, it's got a, a, a real actual motor instead of electric motor. Um, I'm sure it handles just as great. I'm sure it does awesome things, you know, but as far as the electric, the WR8 Flux, um, I love this car. It's amazing, uh, you know, and I hope, I can't wait to see what the future holds for it. I'm sure that I'm going to be able to just make this thing my own with lights and all the other cool stuff and accessories, you know, and it's just, it's just amazing guys. So if you're in the market, if you're thinking about doing it, I'm telling you, just do it. You're not going to be disappointed. It's worth the money, every penny, uh, and HPI knocked it out of the park. All right, guys. Thanks. I appreciate you, you guys watching. I appreciate you going through this journey with me. I appreciate you. Um, getting this far with me and how I'm learning the hobby and learning film and all this other stuff. Please comment below any questions, any critiques, you know, anything you think that I should have done or want to see. Uh, my son Chase, you know, he's going to be involved. Obviously this is his channel. I'm just kind of hijacking it for the time being, but there's a lot of great stuff that's going to be coming. So thanks guys. Appreciate it. Subscribe, 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 thumbs up. Appreciate it.